Finsa of Africa Limited, Zonsel Kenya Limited and Mobile Pay Limited are the new entrants to the lucrative Kenya's mobile phone network operating scene. Now the three will run on Airtel's Kenya's infrastructure and here is KTN's Adelaide Changole with the rest of that report. For several years, the debate on infrastructure sharing in Kenya has dominated the airtime. Safaricom, the leading operator by market share, has often been seen as the target of this debate. But now the regulator says it will be forced to comply. A sharing of infrastructure is something that has now been captured in the 2013 Act. So it is going to be mandatory. According to the authority, network operators are sitting on what it calls idle capacity within a limited spectrum. If shared, the market will witness equal opportunity for all operators and subscribers. They should inculcate in themselves the culture of sharing. And they are not sharing for free anyway. In fact, we are creating another market for them in order to be able to utilize their resources properly. The three firms, Fin South Africa Limited, affiliated to Equity Bank, Zancel Kenya Limited and Mobile Pay Limited will be hosted in Airtel Kenya's network, allowing them to tap into the operator's infrastructure to roll out mobile services, including customer registration, SIM card issuance, billing and customer care to subscribers without holding a Spectrum license. The cost of building a mobile network operator is high, and a few entities have the capacity to invest in such infrastructure. The concept of MVNO gives such small enterprises the opportunity to set up and provide mobile cellular services without the need to heavily invest in the rollout of infrastructure. The regulator, however, insists that this move is not targeted at any particular player, but for optimization of the spectrum. It is just a regulatory issue that we are dealing with in trying to address the complexities that are emerging in this particular market and to ensure that competition thrives. But we are not targeting anybody. Adelaide Changole, KTN Business.